Aquarius is our season. Hey, 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 hey. It's our season. Yes, they hating, anticipating on what we doing, but they gonna have to watch us and uh, uh, and they gonna have to watch us. Uh, 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 get to moving, I uh, get to moving, I uh, get to moving, I uh, get to moving. What? Well, cause you elevating, cause you elevating, cause you elevating, cause you elevating aliens. Hey, what's up, Aquarius? Happy Earth Day, happy birthday. Sorry I missed the, the opening season for us. I am a single mother. Okay, and a single daughter. So I have to take care of home, all right, guys? So, but just know that I was saying, I was screaming, Aquarius, it's our season. So anyway, it's a lot of good things that's going on for us Aquarius, okay? Let's go ahead and pray and give thanks to the Almighty for the blessings that are about to drop into our lap. For the struggle that had got us to where we are today let's let's thank god for that okay most gracious heavenly father thank you for allowing us into your sacred space as you are always allowed into ours father god thank you for divine and protecting myself and my fellow aquarians as we enter into this spiritual realm of the white light father god thank you for the precise and clarifying messages and the understanding thank you for blocking evil thought evil lie evil intent negativity or harmful things over all father god and we return that right back to sender with the bow of love and a prayer father god anyone that is sending love positivity high vibrations of growth elevation something with substance father god we return that right back to sender as well with a bow of love and a prayer for them as well father god thank you for blocking anything that's trying to interfere with my third eye or my discernment or my throat chakra father god thank you again for another year for all the aquarians i pray that everything is a success in their life from this day on forward may they continue to elevate and grow and get closer to you every each step of the way may you walk may you continue to help us with with the manner of walking and talking in with you father god thank you thank you thank you thank you for peace and love joy happiness overall thank you for the blessings thank you for the revelations just thank you thank you thank you we don't know how to say thank you enough i say i say amen namaste okay aquarius so this is what i have to tell you gods and goddesses kings and queens beauties and handsomes ladies and gents and all that are on their divine spiritual journey okay so happy birthday aquarius i'm hearing everybody go ah, aquarius, aquarius. they're rooting for you aquarius okay is big ass blessings that's finished just drop okay i'm pretty sure y'all start seeing some already as far as you know of course birthday gifts but like just things just showing up like god just showing up in your life with the little things okay so something about celebrating you're being celebrated you're going to celebrate people want to celebrate with you okay you're going to be celebrated at this time and happy birthday if your birthday is today by the way okay it is january 22nd as i'm doing this reading at 12.05 a.m. So happy earth day, happy birthday, beautiful or handsome, okay? Enjoy. So everybody can't go, okay? Y'all people, y'all y'all people. Yeah, y'all people. Everybody can't go. Y'all people can't go. All the people that y'all been tight with and all that stuff, they can't go. Where you going, baby? I know it's a hard pill to swallow, but that's just life. You know what I'm saying? Seasons change. People change. All for reasons, seasons, lessons, blessings, elevation, and so forth, okay? I'm getting excited. I'm over here hot. Anyway, it gets lonely at the top, Spirit said, but that's okay. You doing your stuff. And yes, your cutoff game is strong, okay? You are not playing, Aquarius. You're not playing, okay? Something about a doctor's appointment as well, 
okay? You could be going to the doctor to get a checkup or you need to go to the doctor to make a checkup, I mean, get a checkup, make an appointment, it's time, okay? Or you went to the doctor and you're gonna get all positive results. Everything is going to be great. You're gonna hear nothing but great news, okay? Um, I'm meaning positive, like positive answers, okay? Like things that you was concerned about, you're gonna get good news, like nothing to worry about, okay? Something about your cut off, or you need to be cutting off, or you cut off, you just cut off certain energies, okay? Um, the watcher. Change. It's all about change. Let me see. Okay, so Dr. Dre, he's also an Aquarius, okay? So the song is called The Watcher. It goes. Things just ain't the same for gangsters. Times is changing. Young niggas is getting blah, blah, blah. young niggas is aging. Becoming OGs in the game and changing. To make way for these new names and faces. But the strangest things can't happen from rapping. When ninjas get wrapped up in the image and acting. Ninjas get capped up and wrapped up in plastic. Zipped up in bags when it happens. That's that's it. I've seen them. I've seen them come. I seen. I watched them go. Watched them rise. Witnessed it and watched them blow. Watched them blossom and watched them grow. Watched. Watched the lawsuits when they lost the dough. Best friends and money. I lost them both. Went and visit ninjas in the hospital. It's all the same shit all across the globe. I just sit back and watch the show. The watcher everywhere that I go. Ain't the same as before. People I used to know just don't know me no more. But everywhere that I go, I got people I know who got people they know. So I suggest you let's lay low. Okay, so your spirit guides is watching and protecting y'all. Okay, but y'all are also seeing that people, places, and things are changing in your life. Okay, you're, it's something about your growth. Okay, you're leveling up. Okay, something about a new body. You're getting to know your new body. You're getting older. So, like, changing up habits, um, being more uh, focused on what you're putting in your body or something like that, or going to the gym or just eating up, just changing your eating habits and stuff like that. Just changing up. Change, okay? So much love. People want to give you so much much love you're about to receive so much love for your birthday of course but just whatever you doing okay people also want to gift you you about to be um get gifted with gifts from people of this realm and you about to get a spiritual upgrade or something like that okay spiritual gifts or something about your spiritual gifts okay and also you are the eldest of the zodiac sign Aquarius, you are the grandfather of the zodiac uh, chart, okay? You're an old soul, I'm hearing. You're the grandfather of the zodiac. You're friendly, but you're not friendly. You're very intelligent. You love having intellectual conversations. You're very weird and unique in your own way, okay? Um, something about surprise, okay? Something about Valentine's Day, too. I know that's in our season. Happy birthday, whoever birthday is, that's on. But something about Valentine's Day. Somebody wants to give you stuff on Valentine's Day, okay? Something about pop-up. Somebody going to pop up on you on your birthday or around your birthday. Or some people just want to pop up on you, okay? A Taurus, because my dog is coming towards me, okay? Or somebody that drives a Harley or a bike or something. Say hi, everybody. Say hi, Aquarius. Hi, Aquarius. Okay, so, also, okay, don't be kissing me all on, on my neck. Somebody wants to kiss y'all on y'all neck, too, okay? But something about surprise. Um, travel. You could be traveling for your birthday or just you need to travel or you're going to travel or something like that. And also, it's angelic energy around you, too. Your crossed over loved ones, okay? What else do you want to tell them, Holy Spirit? Something about an alien as well. And I'm going to get to y'all angel numbers because I got a couple of angel numbers for y'all as well. And bedrock, okay? <laughs> Aquarius. Y'all have somebody that wants to 
make your bed rock, okay? But anyway, you have people crushing, wishing, missing, talking, kissing, um, miss fucking, touching, stalking, and dissing, okay? Because you rejected them, okay? But as far as wishing, somebody's wishing they could talk to you. Somebody is also lusting after you. Somebody wish they could touch you. And somebody fantasizes about you, okay? It could be a Libra, a Sagittarius, a Capricorn, a Scorpio, a Pisces, or a Virgo, okay? These could be your initials or their initials. L W N L D T G J M. okay? Also, somebody wants to know, would you mind... It could be a Taurus as well. Um, initials JJ, okay? So my name could be JJ, okay? Your spirit team, your ancestors is steady mobbing for you. They are protecting you, okay? Also, it's a big transit that just transpired, I believe, yesterday. Um, Pluto had trans, trans, uh, moved into the sign of Aquarius, okay? Something about change. Yes, yeah, something to do with change and all that good stuff, okay? But, yeah, somebody is crushing on you, wishing for you, missing you, wanting to talk to you, wanting to kiss you, wanting to take you down, okay? Want to touch you, and they stalking, which we already know, and they dissing because you don't want them no more or you don't want to be around them or something. But who cares? Are they paying your bills? No. Anyway, Aquarius. So, oh, that's not what I'm... The angel number. Also, I know that I had said this a while back, but this stuck out to me, Aquarius, okay? You are the god of foresight, okay? Something about your spiritual gifts, okay? And a humanitarian, okay? You're very generous. You're independent. You're open-minded. You never judge until it's time to judge, Okay? Something about your values. You value yourself. You know your self worth. Okay. You're very, you're bluntly spoken. You're kind. You know what I'm saying? You're humanitarian. You're loving. You get a shirt off your back. Okay. So the first number is one. Why? Because you're the one, Aquarius. So let's see. It says the universal life force within you is calling for your attention so some the spirit your ancestors are trying to get your attention at this time pay attention to the signs okay the next number is two there are opportunities for connection and union at this time relationship growth is imminent okay there are opportunities i told y'all this is the winning season okay number 18 as well 18 19 and 65 okay so those numbers can be insignificant. 1, 2, 18, 1965, okay? Or 3, 9, 10, 11, okay? And number 18, your angels are encouraging you to take an inventory of your past experiences in order to understand your current position and lessons, okay? So like I said, cut off game. Um, just... Thinking back on certain situations, you know what I'm saying? Just being enlightened, getting the epiphany of what was and understanding what is, okay? The number 19, let me see. It says, it's okay for you to be powerful. You are being guided by heaven to make ownership, I mean, excuse me, to take ownership of your current situation. And that's what you're doing. Maybe that's why they were trying to get in contact with you because they knew it was time for a change. Okay, Aquarius? Let me get the number 65, and we're about to start the reading. I mean, we started the reading, but you know, getting into the jukes. Okay. So, about 65. Your finances are a reflection of your self worth. Know that God sees you are deserving of blessings and harmony. I told y'all, Aquarius, it's angelic, you know, energy around y'all at this time. Okay. So, let's see the signs of the times, okay? So, I'm going to recover. Y'all could be recovering, okay? Or trying to rest up. You need to rejuvenate your energy, Aquarius. All right, Holy Spirit. Let me get four, uh, four cards. Something about endings. 
cutting off things that no longer serve you, changing. Y'all doing endings and somebody don't want no endings. Okay, honey, you got to come up here, baby. Something about endings. Excuse me, y'all. I got my shirt all up. But something about endings, okay? Y'all could be um, in a number 11 as well, okay? Just things are ending right and left out of y'all life, okay? The number 29 can be insignificant, Okay. January 29th and February 11th, okay? Let me get three more, Holy Spirit, for the sign of Aquarius. It's my party. I can cry if I want to. Something about your journey. Yeah, you ending things. It's part of the journey, Spirit is saying. The number 15 and the number 6. Tired of going in a cycle. Okay, it's been a journey. It's been a long time. A long road. Let me get two more Holy Spirit for the sign of Aquarius. Yeah, disruption. Spirit came and, and seen. It was a disaster. A warning before destruction, I'm hearing. So, Spirit is just like, nah, they can't. I don't, they, they can't go. Four, 41, the number 41 or 40, uh, 45, or the number 5 could be significant here. Let me get one more. Or something about traveling on a plane, okay? It might be a delay or something like that. Listen, metamorphosis, growing, okay? Elevating the number 22, okay? Or the number 4. And love, okay? Your heart. The number eight and your stability okay this is all part of the journey spirit is saying hmm, it would it's a dis you feel like it's a disruption in your love life but it's all for a a right reason okay because whatever you feel like dang it's not working out for me it's because this is not that's not for you that's that it's not equal so spirit had to come and just divine intervention here okay because you're on the up and you're growing and you have no time to be having anything holding you back aquarius okay let me see what you rebelling against rebels your little rebels let me see let's see what does aquarius need to know holy spirit okay take that one. be fucking grateful <laughs> She could be so much worse, okay? So be grateful for the what you got. And that's what you guys are. You guys are grateful, okay? Holy Spirit, what else for the sign of Aquarius? What are they rebelling against? Ooh, thank you. Put the fucking phone down. <laughs> Too much screen time is making you awkward and sad. Go talk to a live person. So, in so many words, Aquarius, stop being detached. Spirit is saying... Go make real friends. Go talk to real people. <laughs> y'all probably just detach in hermit mode and solitude. Saying to y'all self. Fuck fear. What are y'all scared of? Hell no, 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 no. Not my Aquarians. Okay. Anyway, it will lie to your face. Okay. Fear will lie to you in your face. So fuck fear. Fear the saying. You are the best thing to ever happen to you, Aquarius, okay? Go easy on your ass. Buy your own damn drink. You don't need nobody to buy you. Let me buy you a drink. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm going to take you home with me. I got money in the bank. The project that person, that idea is waiting, okay? Get after that shit. The world has your back, okay? The universe has your back. Let me get one more Holy Spirit for the sign of Aquarius. Thank you. You are going through some tough shit. Everyone has their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your tired ass up and handle it. Okay? Handle it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Y'all could be dealing with somebody or you are. You could be a Hispanic descent. 
when I said that, it reminded me of this guy I used to work with named Jose. He said, hey, when we uh, clean up or get ready to close up, I worked at a phone store. So somebody could work at a phone company or something like T-Mobile, Boost, Metro PCS, I'm hearing, Verizon, Cricket, I don't know, whatever, but Spectrum, whatever. But uh, <laughs> we used to have to like, you know, tally up everything and get ready for closing and do all this stuff. So if I say, we'll say what we're going to do. And then we'll be like, handle it. Okay. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let me see. What else do I want for y'all? The juice. Mad because you stay to yourself, Aquarius. They mad. Okay. About to ghost your ass. They, <laughs> somebody talk about how you ghosting people, Aquarius. Yeah, maybe you dropped hints on how you was about to ghost people. Aquarius. What is Aquarius? Somebody is talking about how you spend your money. I'm hearing very materialistic. Like I said, are they paying your bills? So what? No, they're not. <sighs> You're not to be reckoned with, okay? Also, something about an STD or a, a, or a spiritual transmitted demon, okay? Somebody is calling y'all a devil worshiper. <laughs> Aquarius, I told you they all, we already know they always talking. Somebody, somebody saying something about an STD or some just something about a spiritual transmit, uh, spiritual transmitted demon, charmer, manipulator, narcissist, a, a charmer or manipulator, narcissist is in your energy and they are blocked. They have an STD, okay. This is one of one of the devil's minions. I'm hearing they trying to get you, Aquarius. Somebody all up in your pocket. They want to know how you spend your money. Somebody got a side piece. Your your little man or your little Lala is a psycho. Okay, this person could be a devil worshiper. They trying to get in your energy with some type of spiritual transmitted trying to. Uh, give you this spiritual demon but access denied you do not have permission to view this page please check your creden uh, credentials and try again Erico 444 you're divinely protected what else Holy Spirit what else for the sign of Aquarius what do they need to know oh that was a lot Some type of <sighs> mm. okay, okay, uh huh. Mm, somebody trying to play y'all like a hoe, Aquarius. Somebody mad because you, <laughs> I told you, this and reject you, rejected them, so they mad. You dodged an abusive situation or you could have been in an abusive situation or something. You took a, so you taking chances out here on yourself and people mad. Anyway, they out here trying to t talk bad on your name, Aquarius. Okay? Somebody want to fight you. Okay? Because somebody is in love with you and you rejected them. And somebody don't like to be rejected, Aquarius. They feel like you're stingy with your love or you're not really being open about your love life or something. Okay, and somebody that was that you were like in a love situation, they're trying to play you play you like a hoe. They are here talking about you get past, you're like a blunt. Everyone gets a hit. Okay, Aquarius. Somebody talking about your sex is whack. It may my may not be too whack if they talking about it right. 
It's a narcissist, okay? Spirit is saying they're a psycho. They're crazy. They talking about they ain't got no feelings. They was just smashing. They mad because they, they're blocked or something. Somebody is mad. Somebody is playing like they slept with you and they didn't. Like they just putting smut on, they, on your name. Because you blocked them. <laughs> Talking about smoking your life away. Somebody talking about you just all you do is just smoke. Somebody talking about you do witchcraft. You a devil worshiper and you do witchcraft, Aquarius. <laughs> you do anything for love. Ain't that a bitch? This person that's talking all this mess is a hoe dealing with a hoe. So all this stuff that they trying to say about Aquarius, they talking about they damn self and the, and the person that they dealing with. They telling this to somebody else that's a bigger hoe that they trying to project on you, Aquarius. Yeah, testimony. Tell, you, tell your story. You told your story to these people. Yeah, y'all got a cycle around. Talking about a restraining order. Somebody needs a restraining order or you have one. Look, the devil has an agenda. It ain't going to work, though. You divinely protected, remember? Access denied, Spirit is saying. What else, Holy Spirit, for the sign of Aquarius? Told y'all, this is the devil's minion. Want to disrupt your peace, exactly. What is this, Holy Spirit? How everything is going your way and not theirs. Jealous, hating. They're hating because you up and winning. They keep talking about you materialistic because they ain't got shit, Aquarius. What is this? Yeah, they really lost without you. They know that you make a good husband or wife, okay? And like I said, you are divinely protected. So they could say all this stuff. Yeah, they try to say you dirty, okay? When this person has dirty energy, they have dirty, dirty uh, spiritual hygiene, okay? They let any and everybody in their spiritual space, okay? The company they keep, all of that stuff. They dealing with a hoe, a hoe dealing with a hoe, okay? And that, that person that they dealing with, baby. I heard they got the STD, okay? The spiritual transmitted demon. All right, Aquarius. Let's see what this energy is. Somebody name could be David. They try to play you down, Aquarius. What's the energy for Aquarius? I'm using the Aquarius deck. Okay? For the sign of Aquarius. Because it's your motherfucking season. Aquarius. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Will of Fortune. This Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio wants to take a, a risk on you. Or you might have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio in your chart. Or this person does. This person was sad, okay? Five of Cups, this, uh, this person, I heard like, um, better days are coming. You could have been sad, Aquarius, or somebody was sad. You could be seeing crows, okay? Somebody was sad. Somebody also could have lost somebody, okay? Because these crows is out here. What else, Holy Spirit? Somebody is seeing you, like, see how st uh, grounded and stable you are. You are beautiful. You're loving, nurturing, kind. Okay? You're very intuitive. You're, like, very smart. I'm hearing. Very well put together. You're smart. <laughs> You're grounded with your feelings and your money. Or this Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio wants to come and, um, yeah, 
Aquarius. Yeah, Aquarius. <laughs> they want to come take a risk on you. They think about you, okay? They think about, like, this risk. Why is this Five of Cups here? This person was sad. Couldn't sleep. Okay, nightmares I'm hearing. Headaches. Crying. Now, manifesting. Somebody manifesting, y'all. Aquarius, are y'all busy just manifesting, minding y'all business, and then even, don't even, not even paying attention to what's going on in the background? Yeah, somebody is feeling rejected by you. Aquarius, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Or somebody feel like you're going to reject them. Somebody is in their feelings. Somebody feel like you sexy as fuck. They see you a go-getter. You're very ambitious. Or somebody is losing sleep over you. It could be a fire sign or Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Listen, somebody feel like you they equal. Okay? Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. What is this Queen of Cups? Why is this Queen of Cups out here for Aquarius? What is this Queen of Cups? Ooh. <laughs> Somebody wants a passionate beginning with you. Like, I don't know, but they want to come give like some type of a date or something. <laughs> it could be a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? Mm. This is crazy. Queen of Swords. Somebody just bluntly gonna say something to you, Aquarius. It could be another air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. A fellow air sign. Or Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus. Somebody see, it's like, they see, I'm surprised the Empress ain't out here. Queen of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Queen of Rods. Somebody views you as all of this, like, you speak your mind. You're beautiful, ambitious, a go-getter, very intelligent, okay? You're grounded, you're beautiful, you're nurturing, you're loving, you're stable, they see you as the one. What is this four of cups and five of cups? Knight of swords. Something, something about your tongue. It's very, okay, Aquarius. Why is the Knight of Swords here for the Four of Cups and Five of Cups? Ace of Swords. Oh my God, this is the truth. It's something about your tongue. Like, you tell the truth. Like, you stand in your truth. You could be aggressive, but you could be loving. And somebody is scared that you're going to tell them the truth about themselves. Okay? Or you told them the truth about themselves. It was, it's something about your tongue. Somebody feel rejected by you. This Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What is this Queen of Pentacles? Why 
Why is this Queen of Pentacles here? Some type of ending with the Capricorn Virgo Taurus. Somebody now wants to come put in the work. Somebody sees you, sees you in your bag, single, wifey material, hubby material. This Pisces Cancer Scorpio. Or they have this in their chart. It's a lot of air. Somebody's in their head and in their chest. <laughs> okay? It's barely wand and pinnacle out here. It's a lot of air and a lot of water. Why is this hangman here? Why is the hangman here? Listen, somebody want to take y'all on a date. Somebody's thinking about like how to come towards you with about this date or some type of offer, love offer. Okay. Somebody could have a dog. You could have a dog. Somebody could have braids, pink braids, or somebody likes to wear black or yellow, okay? Or somebody wants to come give some type of love note, okay? Somebody works all the time as well. It could have recently been a death around you or them. Why is the Nine of Swords and the Queen of Rods here? Somebody is sad from your past because you walked away from them. It could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They in their head. They they see marriage with you. Okay, or this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio does. I don't know what else to say, guys. I don't know. Let me see. What is this? Oh. Let's get some more clarification. Yeah, somebody feel like you a great fortune, Aquarius. I'm going to check y'all money. I forgot to check y'all money. Why is this Queen of Cups, Page of Cups, and Ace of Wands here? Something about a brand new passionate beginning. Somebody want to move. Look, a rich man wants to make it. A number 13 could be insignificant or the number four. Okay, somebody that, that's like a businessman and somebody wants to invest in y'all, Aquarius. <laughs> somebody sees something with y'all, okay? They want to come in with a, they want to come in and check the temperatures with some type of love offer here, okay? What is this Queen of Swords and this Wheel of Fortune for Aquarius? Mm. Great fortune, good lady. Okay. Some some about great fortune. Okay. The universe is the wheel is spinning. You have been a good lady. Something something about your truth, Aquarius. What? What is this? Four of cups, five of cups, nine of swords, and ace of swords here for Aquarius. The number 26 and the number 6 could be... Or the number 8. Something about your journey. Somebody... You could have rejected somebody due to you elevating. Okay? You get you wasn't finna stay stuck. What is this death... Pinnacle, I mean, Eight of Pentacles and Queen of Pentacles for Aquarius. Something about y'all journey. This is part of the journey. This is what it is. Courtship. Somebody wants to come in and date y'all. Aquarius. Okay. Like casual meetings want to start off like friends at first, but they really want to work on something here. Aquarius. <laughs> Why is the, the hangman here with the knight of cups somebody wants to come and right their wrong somebody is sad okay somebody is stressed out like they stuck in their head thinking about 
some type of love offer here like bringing you flowers or wanting to give you your flowers or are you going to reject them or it's something aquarius the number five the number 32 the number four is out here again what is this eight of cups six of cups nine of swords queen of rods energy expectations you expecting somebody that you walked away from to be in their sorrows i'm hearing wait and pause stand still patience long and desire this person is waiting for you to return but it's not going to happen <laughs> they're longing for you it was something fatality oh my goodness like i said a death around somebody you or them okay or you was expecting something i don't know but something also ended let me get what is this four of wands and king of cups take away remove disappear abandonment this person could have took your in some type of energy from y'all some some sad news okay this person is sad news spirit is saying so it's two energies out here. Y'all have somebody that's want to date y'all, that's new, that's a rich man, and somebody from the past that's in their feelings. Okay, Aquarius. I don't know, Aquarius. I don't know, my babies. What y'all gonna do? Somebody, the wheel is, is turning in y'all favor. Okay. Y'all been doing due diligence with the divine. Y'all been doing God's work, I'm hearing. Y'all been paying attention to the signs and listening. Okay. I'm hearing Aquarius. Woohoo. How you living? Wait, before I get up out of here with a closing, let me do y'all money real quick. Do y'all money. Shmoney. Sorry, Aquarius. I thought I had us together. <laughs> Let's just do a quick little tapping on the dollars before we get up out of here. I pray that y'all like this video, Aquarius. Happy birthday. Happy Earth Day. Okay, turn up. Turn out. Show out. Don't do too much, though. But be smart, okay? It's another year. Some of us another decade. You feel me? Woo! Let me get four cards for Aquarius on their money in the finance department. Holy Spirit, that's one. Three more, please. Two. Okay. Two more, please. One more, please. Thank you. All right. Something to do with a caregiver. Sports and fitness. Writing. And medicine. And at the bottom of the deck, education. Okay. Let me see. It's over here. Dun, dun. Sorry, guys, I had to clean my area a little bit. So let's see what Spirit wants you to know. What is this caregiver for Aquarius? You be child care, home attendant, resident advisor, or just nursing aid, okay, Aquarius? Anchor, money blocks. This is bringing money blocks right here, okay? You feel like you're stuck. What is this um, 
something about water related you could travel as well too or maybe this is just stable for now but you want more okay what is the sports and fitness for aquarius financial growth okay something about sports and fitness you guys could be um trainers or you work at a gym or something to do with like fitness maybe a yoga or something to do with um physical education personal trainer some type of coach or a professional athlete okay financial growth money is is in fruition over there okay you feel stable at this time yeah stuff is spiraling out of control money you need to get more uh not budget, uh, some type of uh, money counselor or something like that, okay? What is this writing? A budget financer or something like that. Some type of something to help you with your money. What is this writing? Wings, okay? Rising above money issues, okay? Writing your plans out, I'm hearing. Okay, you about to profit. This something writing is your life purpose. You about to come out with a book, or you need to write this book, or something like that, or something something to do with writing with a book or a spoken word, or you help people with something. Maybe you're a, a English teacher or something like that. What is this medicine for Aquarius? Something about starting over. Doctor, nurse, technician, pharmacist, medical researcher. Okay. Something about saving up to to go to school for medicines. Okay, it's money coming in slowly. Spirit wants you to know for all of these circumstances right here. Okay. Let me see. What is the anchor and caregiver? What is this energy, Holy Spirit, for Aquarius? What is this anchor and caregiver for Aquarius? Oh, Spirit said they see success in this because you're a humanitarian. You're doing the work. So even though it may seem like money is funny right now, don't worry about it. You're doing what you need to be doing. Okay, slow and steady wins the race, remember? So surround yourself with positive affirmations and visualize your financial success happening now, Spirit is saying. What is this fitness, sports fitness and tree for Aquarius, Holy Spirit? Be forgiving, okay? Practicing self-compassion and forgiveness is important when facing money stress and overcoming hurdles, okay? So... I don't know what that means for y'all, but something about being forgiving, okay? Maybe you need to forgive somebody in the workplace or something like that, or somebody you were working with, okay? So that manyan can come in. <laughs> what is this writing in wings? Don't compare, Spirit is saying. Avoid comparing yourself to others' financial situations as everyone's journey with prosperity is unique, okay? You're getting your wings. You're doing your, you're getting your due diligence. You're getting your what you deserve. Spirit is proud of you. Everybody's journey is different, okay? What is this medicine and eggs? Small steps, Spirit is saying, Okay? Break down your goals into smaller, uh, actionable steps to make them manageable and easier to achieve, okay? And good decisions on all of this, okay? On this educating yourself, starting over, rising above money issues, okay? Financial growth is coming, okay? Everything is coming into fruition, Aquarius. And also money blocks are being lifted because they see success, Okay, they want you to be more forgiving and don't compare yourself and take it's the little things that counts tall small steps. I'm hearing okay, and good decision on educating yourself, Aquarius. Very good. All right, let me give y'all a couple more calls and I'll get up out of here. Like this video, share this video, okay. 
so we can stay in the algorithm or press the notification bell so you know when i load up so we can stay in the algorithm so y'all can see so y'all can get a laugh or learn something too okay or share this with somebody that needs to know that needs to wake up out of the matrix okay all right let's see what the spirit team has to tell you aquarius Aquarius, 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 Aquarius. All right, let me get four cards for the sign of Aquarius. What advice would you like them to have for their season? Spirit team, spirit guides, Holy Spirit. People lose the sleep on how you spending your money. They want to know. They lose the sleep. <laughs> Crazy. Tell them to get in a happy place. Worry about their money. Okay. Judy Garland. Spirit said, think big. Think big, bitch. Okay. Something about the number six as well. Somebody's name could be Judy. Walt. Walter, I'm hearing, or something about Disneyland, okay? The number four, explore your all your possibilities, okay? Let me get two more Holy Spirit for the sign of Aquarius. Somebody's name could be John. The number 10 could be an example, I mean... <laughs> Could be an example. I don't know. Insignificant. <laughs> I don't know why I was about to say that. Spirit said, choose peace overall, okay? And something about your linen. You need to wash your bedding or something about linen, okay? Let me get one more for the sign of Aquarius. I'm going to get you a spiritual AF card and I'm going to get up out of here, okay, Aquarius? I love y'all to life. Enjoy y'all birthday, okay? Somebody name could be Harry Houdini, okay? Always, tr always trust your good. The number 16, okay? The number 10 is out here twice. 10, 10, and the number 7, and the number 16, okay? Always trust your gut. George Michaels, those, that could be somebody's name. Number 36 as well, the number 9. Play, dance, and sing like you always do, Aquarius, okay? Be your uniquely authentic, quirky self, Aquarius. Ain't, no, ain't nothing better, okay, than that. All right, Holy Spirit, let me get some advice for the sign of Aquarius, please. The sign of Aquarius. <coughs> Excuse me. What do you want Aquarius to know, Holy Spirit? The sign of Aquarius. That's too many. They have so much to tell y'all, Aquarius. <laughs> Thank you. Let me just get one. People aren't ignoring you, love bug. Okay? People are busy as fuck with their lives. The way to stop feeling ignored is to get busy with yours. Take up knitting if you have to. Get into it. No one is ignoring you. They're probably just reading or something. Go read. The day you stop worrying... Whether or not someone is ignoring you is the day you get busy as fuck living your own life. So I feel like this is for people that the energies that are around you, Aquarius. It's not that you're ignoring or are you, but I feel like it's them. They're the ones that you're their concern. Okay. All right, Aquarius. I love y'all to life. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and all that good juju. Go tell them. At your homegirl essential energy house, okay? And the address is 8408. And they gotta come in with a vibe. And that vibe is they gotta like a video. Subscribe to the tribe. Okay, turn on that noti bill so we could be in the algorithm, baby. Okay, happy Earth Day birthday. It's our season. Your winning season. Aquarius, I love you, my babies. I'll get back with you. Peace.